Begin in child's pose. Knees wide, hips drawing back and down, and arms stretching forward. Start to settle in as you deepen your breath and relax into the floor. Draw each inhale deep into the belly and then surrender a little more into the support of your mat with each exhale. Baby camel, inhale, roll up, reach back, and lift your hips high. As the hips press forward, feel the psoas lengthen. Lower the hips, hands forward for tabletop. Inhale, cow pose, stretch your head high and your tail high. And exhale, cat pose. Draw your chin to your chest and round your spine. Keep going on your own. Come back to neutral. Extend your right leg out wide to the side. Press the edge of the right foot down. From here, thread the needle. Inhale, left arm up. Exhale, thread the left arm through. Twist right. Take a breath in. Exhale to bind. Right hand to opposite hip crease. Breathe deeply as you hold this twist. Slowly rise back up to tabletop. Other side, left leg out wide to the side, anchor through the outside edge of the foot. Thread the needle, inhale, right arm to sky. Exhale, thread the right arm through and twist left. Breathe in here. As you exhale, Move into the bind, left hand to opposite hip crease. Hold the twist and breathe. Slowly unwind and come back to tabletop. Make your way onto your back. Flip the palms to the mat, press through palms and feet, and lift the hips for bridge pose. Then lift the heels high. Heels stay lifted. Lower and lift your hips a few times. Stay high up on the balls of your feet the entire time. The next time your hips are up, pause. Now lower the heels down and then release the hips down to the mat. Wheel, feet hip width. Place your hands by your shoulders, fingertips point toward you. Come first onto the crown of your head, then slowly straighten the arms. Keep straightening through the arms and driving the feet down as you breathe. Exhale, release to your back. Now take the feet out wide to the edges of your mat and let the knees come together for a moment.
gently draw both knees up close to your chest. Grab behind your hamstrings and rock yourself all the way up, then make your way down onto your belly. Sphinx Pose. Walk your hands forward and prop yourself up onto your forearms. Stay here or move to Seal Pose. For Seal, pivot your forearms out to a 45 degree angle with the top of the mat. Then press the hands down and lift the elbows up. Slowly begin to straighten the arms. For less sensation in the lower back, Walk your hands out and away from you. For more, walk them in. Release down, arms by your sides, left cheek to the mat and breathe. Slowly bring the hands by your shoulders. Right shoulder peels off the mat for cobra twist. Take your gaze right. Feel the right mid-back engage to help you twist even more to the right. Exhale, release back down. Half frog, right side. Prop yourself up on your left forearm. Grab your right foot with your right hand and pull your right foot gently to the outer hip. Maybe stay here. Maybe spin the right fingers all the way forward to drape over your toes. Release back down, left cheek to the mat. Slowly bring the hands by your shoulders. Cobra twist, left side. Feel the left shoulder up, gaze left. Heavy the hip bones into the mat, elbows hugging into the side body as you twist. Breathe out, release down. Half frog, left side. Come onto your right forearm, capture your left foot with your left hand and draw your left heel to your outer hip. Maybe spiral left fingers to drape over the toes to increase the stretch in your left shoulder. Release back down. Take a moment here. Slowly bring the hands by your shoulders. Press yourself up then have a seat on your mat. Chano twist, left leg long, right foot inside, left inner thigh. Right hand behind you, left hand to your knee, and twist right. Take your gaze beyond the right shoulder. Release the twist. Inhale the arms up. Turn your torso to face your right knee. Exhale, right arm over to the left. Keep the right hip anchored down as you reach. Start to rise. Set up for Marichasana A. Keep the left leg long and step the right foot next to the right hip. Hinge forward and slip your right shoulder just in front of your right knee. Then 
Reach the arms behind you. Once you're in the bind, inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, drape the torso over the front leg. If the hands don't quite meet in the bind, you can also let the hands rest somewhere along the extended leg. Slowly rise back up. Let's move on to the other side. Jano twist. Right leg long, left foot to right inner thigh. Left hand behind you, right hand to your knee and twist left. Move the left shoulder back and take your gaze over the left shoulder. Slowly unwind. Inhale the arms up, torso points to left knee. Exhale, left arm up and over to the right. Left hip stays anchored as you lengthen through the side body. Slowly rise. Mari Chasana A. Right leg stays long. Left foot moves near the left hip. Bend forward and sneak your left shoulder on the inside of your left inner thigh. Bind the arms behind you. Then inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, fold over your extended leg. If you don't quite have the bind, you can also reach the hands out for the right foot or the shin. Slowly rise up. Begin to make your way down onto your back. Extend your right leg long towards the sky and extend your left leg long on the mat. Then bring your left hand to your left hip. Hold the right leg with the right hand and sweep the leg out wide to the side for an inner thigh stretch. Use the left hand on the left hip bone to help keep the hip anchored to the mat. Other side, lower the right leg down to the mat and extend the left leg to the sky. Bring right hand to right hip, left hand holds the leg, then sweep the leg wide. Keep both hips even on the ground, then maybe take the left leg even more to the left. Release the pose. Pull your knees up close to your chest. Before we end, if there's any other poses you'd like to do, like a twist or a happy baby, take some time for that now. 
and then when you're ready, move into Shavasana, arms and legs long. Thank you for sharing your practice with us. Namaste.